We were a family, and for the first time since the virus, we were living somewhere truly safe, making every day feel like, well, like Christmas morning. Hello! <laughs> Merry Christmas! How do you tell? Santa. What would you like for Christmas, little girl? A pony. No, I'd actually really like you to stop calling me little girl. Well, technically, you are little and you're a girl. Well, uh, I am not a little girl, Santa, but do you know what I would like? I don't give a fuck what you'd like. Not to sound too sentimental, but those days at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue may have been the best days of my life. And that's counting pre-Z. Wait a second. Oh my God, no. It's a first edition Tolkien and, and you wrote in it. There's my name right there, marring this perfectly preserved paper. Thank you, and yours too. You didn't stop. Thank you so much. It's a bit touching. Hey, you know, I couldn't find uh, any wrapping paper, but don't worry about it. Just tear it open. It doesn't matter. It's only Taft. He's our fattest president, so there's actually quite a lot left over. If you need some wrapping paper, Columbus, I didn't get anything from you. Just what I wanted. Another gun. Oh, hey, well, not just any gun, a Colt 45, and not just any Colt 45, the kings. Uh, England, Denmark, Liechtenstein? There's only one king. Elvis, Aaron, fucking Presley, the greatest who ever lived, the king of kings. Uh, he yes. gave this gun to Nixon when he visited the White House, and I, uh, I give it to you, locked and loaded. Yeah, he used to shoot that colt in his backyard. King's Palace, Memphis, Tennessee. Did I tell you about Graceland? Only like a hundred times. Well, we're gonna go there together someday. You no, know, I actually think I'm gonna go shoot this right now. I think I uh, saw some Z's down by the reflecting pool. Well, I'll go with. I'm gonna go by myself. It's Christmas. It's not fucking Christmas. It's November 17th. Little Rock was on the hunt, all right, for people her own age. And the thing is, they were out there. We just made it a point to keep our distance which would kind of suck if you were the one stuck in the nest. God, this is really terrifying, yeah, but totally unrealistic. Well, hey, she'll be fine. Wish she didn't remind me so much of me. Hey, come on, what's, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Nothing. All right, I, I wasn't gonna do this now. You always say that, like, I play it too safe. And I know we've been in, like, a bit of a rut lately. So I thought, what better way to spice things up than to... Get married? Yeah, I mean, well, I was gonna say, get married, yay. Is that yeah. the Hope Diamond? <laughs> well, I certainly hope it is. I want you to be Miss Ohio, or I guess like Mrs. This Ohio. This is so unfair. You know how I feel about this. What? We've talked about this. In my limited but absurdly painful experience, married people only do one thing. What, fight? We, we already do that. Get divorced. No, well, I don't see us going that route. I mean, where would we find the lawyers? I don't know what to say. Well, don't say anything, yet. Okay, this was my fault. You know what, I, I put you on the spot. Just think about it and let me know whenever you're ready and everything will work out exactly as it's supposed to. Mm. Hey, Buttercup. What's wrong, get a little too much eggnog last night? Bad news. Bad news? Well, you know what cancels out bad news? Good news. Today is the day that Wichita says... Adios. Hmm? Dear c and we feel like total shit about leaving. Sorry, not good at notes, W and L R. Well, yeah. Yeah, not good at notes is a pretty huge understatement. You know he's gonna take this beast thing pretty hard? Well, he should learn to not get so attached. Never get attached, remember? That was the problem with Columbus. He got too attached. Well, with Tallahassee, it's like he thinks he's my dad. Sure, but you are so lucky you don't have a boyfriend. Have you seen him use Q-tips? His bedtime routine took an hour. Stop. On it. Oh, my God, sorry. No, what? stop. Stop. Oh.
Namaste. Hi. <laughs>